Hello everyone, in this high-yielding short, I am going to tell you about Whipple's disease which is due to Trophyrima Whippellii, a gram-positive actinomyces. Here you have to understand uh, Whipple's disease can be diagnosed on the biopsy where lamina propria will be showing you macrophages which will be containing lysosome and these lysosomes will be having all these Trophyrima Whippellii bacteriums, right? And when you are going to see the microscopic examination, HE section will be showing you only one thing that is the lamina propria is flooded by the foamy macrophages on pass staining with diastase resistant you can identify the bacteria because they are pass positive and diastase resistant why we are adding this diastase so that diastase can digest the glycogen and bacteria will be remaining there so these are pass positive diastase resistant that will be trophyrima vapellii right now this is the biopsy you can see this is the your he section and full of the lamina propria is showing you foamy macrophages so lamina propria is showing you foamy macrophages in this biopsy which we can confirm by the pass positive and diastase staining so now you can see this is the pass positive diastase staining so lamina propria is showing you macrophage lysosome is containing pass positive and diastase resistant bacilli how come we know that this is the lysosome for that we have to look into the mic uh, electron microscope and electron microscope will be showing you can you see this is the micro this is the macrophage and these are the intracellular bacilli you can see these are the intracellular bacilli within the lysosomes there will be some extracellular bacilli also will be visible in this Whipple's disease enjoy learning best wishes